It is the grand final of the DP World ILT20 for 2023, the inaugural season, and with a very good crowd building. The Vipers qualified first, Wanindu Hasaranga. Toss made earlier, James Vince called correctly. Called heads, it was heads. And as they have done so often throughout the tournament, the golf giants will field first. On trucks four and five, truck five belongs to Niall O'Brien. We have, I hope that's not Niall O'Brien's truck, two umpires for this evening, two international quality umpires, both of England, Alex War. Well, just looking at the two teams, they just seem so evenly matched. Back, backroom staff. The left-handed Rohan Mustafa. Just 182 runs in his 11 matches in the tournament so far. And Colin de Grondon with the new ball will bowl to Mustafa and Alex Hales who has been brilliant, was brilliant at the start of the tournament. Throughout the preliminary rounds, a playing tonight. A little bit of... Advancing, gets it through the gap, first boundary of the final. Skyexchange.net, Super 4. Chance and gone! Early breakthrough for the Giants. Brathwaite does it again. They know it's a massive wicket. Alex Hales goes for one, it's eight for one. Oh, is that close or is there an edge? He's off. Run him out anyway. Run him out anyway. Rohan Mustafa goes for six. Oh, that'll change things a little bit. Live down the wicket and one bounce four. On the field right now. Fielder down there, and he's gone right on the edge. Disappointment for Adam Lythe. He's 25 for three. There's that reverse again, and he gets it away this time. A welcome boundary. Winning the toss, selecting to field first. Oh, yes, please. Yes, please, Chris Jordan. How many times have we seen this? Monroe's got to go for six. 44 for four. Lovely shot, good timing as well from Saranga. Got the general secretary of the Emirates Cricket Ball, Mulashir Asmani, with us, and they sort of lead that UAE side, who, who are looking to play a lot of cricket in the next five, six months. Yes, you know. I wish you all the best for uh, the rest of tonight, and I'm sure for what is to come for the DP World ILT20. Thank you, thank you so much, and we'll be... Four, that will be four, I'm sure, races away down through a fine third. Way over backward point, poor delivery, good shot. And again, that is really clever from Hasaranga. Just the one bounce four. And again, backward a point, timing perfection from Hasaranga. Hasaranga into the gap, strong enough, yes, boundary. The stairs late side, and that's a 50 partnership. Oh, big shot, Asaranga all the way. Great flight. Pulled again, leg side, that's another maximum, that's six more. Fair play news, biggest hit, but that's a little baby. Tried for the Yorker, and they're pushing for two. Billings is quick. And 50, what an innings! Tremendous effort from this uh, gifted cricketer. Standing ovation from his team and uh, his supporters. Here. Sam Billings, does he get it over the top? What a catch! VC, big fella, big catch! Billings, 31, 16 for five. Asaranga goes for him. Fielder down there, and it works, the spinner gets him back in. The danger man departs, Hasaranga for 55, one one six for six now. It's a brilliant Yorker. Oh, it's not good fielding in the deep. That's in the air, should be taken, and it is. Chris Lane at point, seventh wicket down, Luke Wood gone for three, 130 for seven. 
He's gone though. Excellent bowling from Carlos Brathway. And there's that celebration of his. Manipulate his pads because he's gone. Gone for 13. 134 for eight. Lovely clip. Lovely, lovely clip. Oh my word! Colin the ground home. Brilliant shot. Brilliant, brilliant hit. Chris Jordan is not happy because he had two men. Try and get back for two if you can, Alina here. Turn and go. Very good. Decent last over by two tail enders. Nine off it. 20 overs done. Gulf Giants were brilliant. 146 for eight. We feel up here in the commons buckets. 20 below par. Take nothing away from the Gulf Giants. They were exceptional with the ball. The talk in the dressing room will be listen, lads. We're only halfway there. Yeah, very good. Well done, Chris Jordan as well. Closed out well. Colin de Grandhomme. The Gulf Giants, to get their hands on the trophy, they're going to need 147 from their 20 overs. Been in good voice tonight. The locals have uh, turned out in numbers. The Giants have been brilliant with the ball and in the field. Can the Vipers find a way? Yeah, there's no doubt that they have got bowling to defend any sort of total, but... Uh, 70%, 75%, I would think, from a Giants point of view. James Vint, Chris Lynn, 206 runs. He came just uh, slightly late into the tournament, but he's been good over my Emirates a couple of nights ago. 65 for the first wicket in that game. Fireworks to get things underway for the second innings tonight from a left-handed point of view in this Giants lineup. In the top seven, eight. Yeah, all the way down. Swung away. It's gone high. It's off the top edge, and I think it'll be all the way. Fair play news. Biggest hit contender. Pulls this one powerfully, and that is smashed away. Sky Exchange. .net Super 4. That has been hammered by Chris. Oh, chance for a court and bold, and it's gone straight through the hands. Oh, that is beautifully timed by James Vince. May win that still. Edge, oh, there it is. There's the breakthrough they wanted. That's also the... Something is just coming back. They're pulling it back. 25 for one. Goal! Goal, Tom Curran! What a bowling change! Pitch it up, a little bit of nip back. They've got the second. Back at the game, big time, two consecutive wickets. Under pressure, second wicket gone for one. Grand home, 26 for two now. In the air. Sliced away, third is inside the ring. It's a much needed boundary. It's, it's a better option. That's a really good option from Erat Erasmus. Oh. oh, don't go back, Erasmus. Do not go back. Crunched, crunched. Really good hit from Chris Lynn. Sweep again. Powerful sweep. We've all got a favourite event. Oh, that's nicely played in the gap. Will be six. Got to be straight. Got to be short. That one finds the gap, though. Yeah, it does. Not even. Got plenty. Got plenty, has he or not? No, he has not. Caught a beautiful catch. Rasmus gone for 30, well played. 99 for three. Push for two, and they'll take two comfortably. 50 for Chris Lynn. Very fine half century, open the batting. And he's picked up 50 off 39. Not job done yet, but he'll feel pretty good about half the job. Well, that's a very good strike rate, 128.2. Hurled away into the leg side. Oh, big shot. Just over the top of mid on. Is it going to skip on, skip away? Full length down the ground. Fielder out there. Oh, he's got away with it. And the ball skips away, mate. Full toss. Oh, beats the fielder, it's four more, that's damage. Full toss again, 
pumped into the leg side. There's nobody there. It's gone for four more. Lawful toss again into the leg side. He might get four more here live. Where's that gone? That's it, that will do nicely. Fabulous innings from Chris Lynn. He finishes on 72 from 50. All the dugout runs on and congratulates these two at the crease. It's a giant's day. They are the inaugural winners of the DP World ILT20 and how they've done it in style. Terrific chase, terrific scenes here in the wonderful city of Dubai. Well, as a player, when you're training hard in the off season, it's for these moments. It's to win trophies, it's to have success. You work so hard as a player, brilliant from the Giants. They were chasing down 147. They've done it in 18.4. Star of the show, Chris Lynn there. Just look at that, 72 from 50. Let's have a look at the bowling card. Just the five bowlers, Cottrell, 3.4 overs, none for 24. A wicket each for Wood, the current. Asaranga was a threat, but they kept him out really well. So there's the match summary. Desert Vipers, 146 for eight. In truth, you'd say 20 minimum short. Asaranga play beautifully for 55. Mr Khalid Al Zaruni to present the DP World International League T20 Trophy to James Vince and the Gulf Giants. Congratulations. Well, how special is this? What a wonderful feeling for all the team, the backroom staff, the owners, winners. There's no better feeling. The inaugural DP World ILT20 competition goes to the Giants. Wonderful there at the presentation, the ceremony, the interviews. Been played in a superb spirit as this competition. And I'm sure every one of these players and the teams will want to come back. And there's more. Always oh, somebody lies in the front, it's Hetmeyer. Fireworks go into the night sky. Looks to have been a real family affair, does this? I think for all teams. For more updates, subscribe to our YouTube channel and click on the bell icon. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Download T-Sports app to enjoy exciting games and highlights. Visit tsports.com.